Smoke and noise filled the air. The All-Seer was here in the middle of this fight. With two dual-sided sabers on his back and the red gloves adorning his hands, Hector went forward. No one other than he knew it yet, but he was bringing a storm with him. At first, Petra thought the smoke had somehow entered her mech suit helmet and was screwing with her vision. Hector, are, are you seeing this? I'm causing it. Huge panes of glass shattered on both sides of her. Petra watched as the glass cracked all the way up the building. The panes cracked in the middle, ripped from their places on the building, then shattered a hundred more times while hovering in the air. They remained there for a few moments, then rushed toward Hector, surrounding him. He stopped walking, and the glass shards created an opening that led to him. Stay within the barrier, Bird. Petra realized that there were 50 enemy troops, all roughly the same huge size, and heading toward them. Broken glass, tables, chairs, wiring, all of it was heading for the soldiers. Everything Hector could grab from these buildings. His voice came through her calm. The enemy sees us. When he put the gloves on, his mind became his hands, and his weapons were anything he could feel. His skill with this weapon allowed him to attract and move practically anything. Hector took two steps and launched himself up and forward. His gloved hands reached for the sabers on his back and he ripped them free. The spinning debris rushed past him and Petra, parting for the two as if they were a rock in a river. Broken trash turned deadly as it reached the Myrmidons. He saw the All-Seer 200 meters away, and the mutant saw him too. Bird, stay here. 10,000 sabers wrapped around the Titan, circling her body and forming a cocoon of lasers for her protection. Hector took off, his powerful legs pumping, his feet slamming into the ground as they dodged bodies from both armies. Hector knew what was coming. He understood how the All-Seer moved, when he moved, and had a grasp on why he moved. At 10 meters, the All-Seer made his move, exactly as Hector expected. The All-Seer went for the flourish. Hector recalled the most likely finishing move and forced his body to react. He spun, his body moving in the opposite direction of his face. The black whip sliced through the air that should have been Hector's body. The Martian was already calculating the next move, shoving his heels down and throwing himself to the ground. Hector's momentum allowed him to somersault backward and pop to his feet unscathed. Part of the storm broke off, turning into a swarm of 10,000 objects moving in different directions toward the same destination, the All-Seer. Exhibition or full victory, that was why Hector had come. <laughs>